Well, welcome back. Are you ready? Are you, are you ready? Are you laced up? No. 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 <laughs> are you training? I walk. Okay, all Steps. right. Well. Yeah. Well, if not, you better get a move on. You got a little more than three months to be ready for the annual Mercy Health Glass City Marathon. Yeah, so race director Clint McCormick and Jeff Swartz, a Mercy Health physical therapist, joins us this morning. Uh, so it's January. We're in the third week. <laughs> this is the third week of January, right? Yeah. And we're all talking right. about running 26.2 miles. Mm -mm. Or... Or 13.1. Okay. Oh, yeah. That 3.1. Okay. Talking more. Right. That's my right. speed right there. <laughs> so, yeah. So, the whole weekend, um, April 22nd and 23rd, we're 95 days away from race day. Mm -hmm. um, but, yeah, we do have several options. Um, but those of you who are kind of looking for the, the higher end of that right. echelon, the marathon, half marathon, that training did start three weeks ago. So, we're, we're in our third week of training. Mm -hmm. um, we're only 95 days away, believe it or not. So, wow. Well, you know, it's like you can't just get up one day and say, I'm going to run 20. Unless you're right. John Birchfield, but like he yeah, does. John, yeah, John, John does that in his sleep, uh, really. Yeah, he, he does. does. So, you know, you Dogs. can't just wake up one day and say, like, I'm going to do this. You right. need to train for it. And yeah. it takes months to do that. It does. Um, to properly train, right. um, yeah, it, it does take the dedication, the commitment, the, the social atmosphere, um, and you have to listen to your body. Mm -hmm. um, and that's kind of where Jeff and his team come into place is to make sure that we sign them up. Hand him off to Jeff, and he mm. gets me to the finish line. Okay, well, Jeff, you're the man of the hour then. <laughs> People want to talk to you. So, uh, third week of training. Mm -hmm. uh, so, uh, what are you seeing right now? What are you suggesting for those who are training for this marathon? So, uh, some of the injuries that we're seeing are injuries that were aches and pains that back in February or uh, uh, October or September yeah. that never get addressed. Mm. You know, I've been racing for 35 years. I know that we're going to have aches and pains and it's getting those aches and pains addressed early on, not letting them go months. My job right now is to make sure that people get to the starting line and then once we're in the race, then we're going to hopefully keep everybody safe with doctors and nurses and therapists and first responders out on course to keep get everyone to the finish line then. Mm -hmm. But making sure that you're running slowly now is going to ensure that you can run fast later and you can get to the finish line. So, so can you train me right now <laughs> to get me prepared for April? I can tell you what not to do, okay. but the, the good thing is there are local training programs yeah. that can tell you what to do. Mm -hmm. okay. so, beautiful, beautiful. Is this something that people could sign up for to be part of this training? Yeah, so right now we're probably about 30%, 35% of our field is signed up. Those okay. are people who have made the commitment. Mm -hmm. um, what we typically find is a lot of people are procrastinators. They want to see <laughs> what is the weather going to be on race day, right? So they're going to wait until late. They're going to see how's my body doing with my training? Um, what are my friends doing? What does my wife let me do? Right, so all the other <laughs> factors that kind of go into registering for an event, um, those people will sign up in the next two months. But I will say right now, the half marathon is only $75. Um, I believe there's about 250 spots left and the price goes up. The marathon, uh, I believe is at $100. There's about 100 spots left in those before the price goes up. So mm -hmm. if you're looking to save some money, don't procrastinate. Mm -hmm. But if you just want to listen to your body, um, really, March 31st is kind of our cutoff to make sure we get you all the swag items that you really sure. want. Sure, you don't awesome. want to miss out on that. Yeah, so uh, how many years for the Glass City Marathon and, and, and how, uh, how special of an event is this? Yeah, so we're going into our 46th year. Um, it's one of the oldest marathons in the country. Um, and this year, we're, we're kind of blessed to be recognized as the Roadrunners Club of America National Championship. So that's kind of the most prestigious um, award we can get from kind of our parent organization, the Roadrunners Club of America. So um, we, the last few years, we've received Race Director of the Year, we received the Race of the Year, and now we're the National Championship. So with that, uh, we're seeing a really a, a strong influx of our elite athletes coming to race for that. So not only is our race really fast and flat, it's a Boston qualifier, but it's a sanctioned event, so people can qualify for the Olympic trials on our course as well. So we're oh. starting to see a lot of those runners start to come to our area. Nice. So it is a big deal. It is. Absolutely. A very big deal. And, um, you know, everybody wants a, a good track to run to qualify for that. For Whatever this. you might, right? Yeah. Whether you're an age grouper or you have mm -hmm. aspirations for running the Olympics. Um, I, I do believe that, you know, we have a really good Midwest value type of event, you know, where everybody matters mm -hmm. in our field. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So, uh, Jeff, for folks at home right now, maybe um, they're procrastinating, <laughs> as Clint <laughs> mentioned. Uh, what would you suggest for them right now to get, you know, prepared for this race? Start slow. Get a great pair of shoes. We've got some great local shoe uh, stores in town. Go there, get fitted for a great pair of shoes. Get into a training program. 
um, that starts slow. Don't bite off more than you can chew. I like that. He's talking about chew, so he's talking yeah. about my speed now. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Shoes. I can mm -hmm. get excited about that. They're not Just laced. Open. They're not laced up right now, though. <laughs> so here's what we're gonna do. So we're on the, couch. the one, we're the one event we didn't talk about Here was the five-person marathon relay. Here we the go. Relay. I see it in your eyes, Clint. Here you we know go. Gonna get a good day ask. team together. Lay, lay it on. My me. annual ask. Okay. <laughs> Stephen Jackson's gonna start us off. <laughs> okay. All right. It's 3.1 miles for the first leg. Okay. okay. Can, right? You can do that. Hey, you did that. Yeah, I can do that. Perfect. Because the next leg is handed off to you. And it's eight miles or something crazy. Not quite. No. Right. Right. You know, but if you're smart about this, you can also get John to be in your team. Yeah, and he can just do three of them together. Well, not quite. He can be part of your team. Do okay. one leg. Right? Okay. Okay. You know? Right. And then, and then we got who else? We Chris. Chris Vickers. Chris. Yeah. Well, yeah. We're roping he runs. Chris. Yeah. And Ryan right. Weekman has long legs. He's got long legs. But I don't know about the stamina though. Like with Ryan, yeah. hey, he, we got, he likes a lot of donuts. We'll get him there. <laughs> we'll work with them. <laughs> okay. Right. Um, the what course does have a time limit, but it's very the relaxed. The time limit. Okay. It's very Amanda, relaxed. Amanda, you have to get it done. <laughs> <laughs> you, you on your, on your own days. power. <laughs> so tell us again before we let you go, Clint, what, what's the cutoff day to sign up and, and when is the actual marathon? Race weekend, April 22nd and 23rd, 95 days away. Seems like it's far away, but it's really not. Not really. Right? Um, GlassCityMarathon.org is the place to go to register. Uh, register by March 31st. And awesome. get training now. And mm -hmm. yes. start slow, take it easy, get yourself some new shoes. Don't take off, don't bite off more than you can chew. Right, and take care of those injuries if you got yes. anything Absolutely. lingering. Very yep. good, Jeff, thank you. Clint, yep. thank you so much. Thanks.